My name is Juba Kalamka. I was born in Chicago, Illinois, uh, in the North Lawndale neighborhood and grew up in the Austin neighborhood on the far west side. Pronouns are he, him, she, her, them, they. As working as an artist for roughly 40 years of my life and then probably as a musician primarily since the, with a couple of gaps since the late 80s, I would say. And, and the primary uh, space for that has been uh, hip hop. Uh, a, a lot of digital production work that that sort of turned uh, into, aside from doing vocal hip hop, and as an extension of that more performance uh, as a porn actor, as, uh, and as performance art as a sort of lateral extension of the hip hop stuff that I do. I had some opportunities to be able to do that as well. My process now has been largely shaped by my experience of doing hip hop in the very early 90s. I was in a, a, the, the, the Chicago hip hop scene in the early 90s, hosting parties, uh, doing music, and that was when I started dabbling in production. I think that uh, if I had collage, a collage would be the way that uh, I just would to kind of describe the way that I, that I work in whatever I'm doing now. That or like if, if I'm doing a sound collage around a poem that someone has done, what I'm doing is listening to the poem, listening to particular phrases and particular words in the poem and seeing if there's and using those as as either reference points or triggers, so to speak, for different uh, memories of like, OK, what do I know? that as a sound bed sounds like this from something that I watch. And it might be something I watched 40 years ago and have not seen since then. We Real Cool, if you said We Real Cool, I think about uh, elementary school, for one, because that was just the poem, one of the poems that got done over and over again during Black, <laughs> during Black History Month. And I think about Walking on Sunshine by Central Line. Oakland, the Panthers. Uh, mid 1970s grindhouse uh, theater in Chicago. Gwendolyn Brooks, Norman is at you. Black exploitation era, Cooley High, JD's Revenge. Uh, Bell Hooks, because I think about the book uh, We Real Cool and Black Men and Masculinity, and how that book has informed a lot of my work in terms of trying to create things in a way uh, that's like I guess Bell Hooks has written like 30 books or something, but this was uh, this was the first. I, I, I love what I love about that was it that it, it's it, it's a it's a piece of art. I mean, it's, it's academic, but it's a piece of art in that it's basically a 175 page book that I could give to the average cat who I see walking down the street. I'm working on a couple of different projects uh, right now, uh, finishing uh, both a another album of sound collage and interstitial music uh, of my own. Uh, I'm completing uh, my first poetry anthology. Um, it's called Son of Byford. Um, it's coming out, uh, I guess, the beginning of 2019. Um, that I'm, and both of those projects, I'm having a lot of fun. 